Maybe they should feel this. Feel the pain that we... <laughs> Are you kidding me? Was that... Is that... I thought she was joking. I know! What? What do you I mean? Saw I thought this she was joking. This is the second time joking. it's happened! I thought she was joking. I thought you were doing one of your Sakanya little jokey jokes. No, I felt live okay? on TV because we're in the makeshift studio. Oh Thank you, goodness. friend, for helping I'm sorry. me. Sorry, I thought I was like, oh, I thought you were oh joking about gosh, the heels. I'm gonna have to switch to navigating for Casey through the studio so he doesn't walk in front of the camera. Oh, wait, here we go. He kills viruses in just what? What did you do, Mom? Dad, holy crap! Uh, it's been around a long time, um, and as a result, it does take quite a long time to make change even with the best one in the world. This evening, both will expire at 10 o'clock in the morning. What's up, Casey? And we are looking at what will likely be another round of some light snow flurry activity. Hey, what's up, Casey? So surprised. It's a long-time city ordinance that allows these businesses, these practices, to occur only until 10 o'clock at night during the week. Right then. Oh, oh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's what happens on live TV when you're trying to have a little fun. Wow. Thank you, Derek. Yes, is trying to figure out what to do on all this. Have I got a bug on me? I do have a you bug on me. You just flipped it on me. Well, I'm sorry, but wow. I kept feeling this thing on my neck, and I'm like, what is this? That's really gross. That really just happened. Oh, it's a cricket. No, that's, I don't what know. What is that? Let's just go. So if your apartment does not have, if your apartment does not have air conditioning, reporting live in the Mount Eaton section of the Bronx, Darla Miles, Channel 7 Eyewitness News. That update, really appreciate it, Chris. My pleasure. That's Chris Murphy oh, of the falling. Weather Network. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is he okay? The Are wind you okay? just blew me down. Oh, my gosh. I'm okay. The wind, Are you the wind sure? just blew me down. Oh, my gosh. I'm yep. sorry. We've had gusts up to 120 kilometers an hour. In okay, get inside. Be safe. Case. Thank you so much, Chris. <laughs> Thank you. Be careful. <laughs> Thanks again to Chris Murphy of the Weather Network in St. Just about everybody is wondering, how did this guy get into this storm drain? You can see that it's very heavy. Just trying to pull it off. <laughs> And then look at the diameter. It's not that big. I can get my hands down in there, but I don't know. Oh, my head and my shoulders. Yeah. That's uh, I thought he was actually teaching the whole class. Like, I thought that's what a professor might get. He is the teaching the whole class well, as an instructor. Okay. Well, twelve thousand dollars not a lot of money. That wouldn't even pay half your child support or half your uh, your student loans. So. Child support. Oh, that's me. That's me. Would pay half your student loans. I think a twelve thousand oh dollars sounds God, about I what got I pay. No child support. <laughs> she lies. <Whatever>. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny Condon, can you please take over from here? Continuing to move to the northwest, northwest, or northwest, northwest. We talked about picking safe Halloween costumes earlier, but now let's focus on how to save money on those costumes. Right now, Tyra Majors is live at Bakersfield Workwear and Costumes with all the tips you need to know. Are <laughs> Tyra, you were looking quite delicious this morning, I have to say. Wow. <laughs> Do I look like a tasty Popeye's chicken sandwich? I am not going to answer wow. any of these questions. I, I kind of want to eat myself, but <laughs> I can't. <laughs> pleasure yourself with that food. <laughs> that came out wrong. I don't know Give yourself pleasure when you're eating. You know what I'm saying. You know, I like to eat candy corn one color at a time. If you're really getting OCD you're a about it. Well, I'm not always a nibbler. I'm kind of a gobbler. <laughs> I eat a lot of candy. <laughs> Come back. Come back. We're <laughs> oh God! Do you understand how often we get that close? I'm sorry. Valley starting Saturday night into Sunday. That high wind watch. 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 Okay. I think I got it. We're going to be tracking that high wind watch in place as we go throughout Saturday night into your Sunday. High wind watch. High wind watch. High wind watch. High wind watch. Why is that so hard? High wind, high wind, high, 
high wind watch, high wind watch, high wind watch, high wind. <laughs> I'm over it. <laughs> One bizarre Instagram account has hatched a plan, an egg plans to break the record for most likes on a popular photo sharing app. Bri is laughing. <laughs> but she said egg as an E-G-G. <laughs> but now an excellent account called World Record Egg is going to whisk it and take on the challenge. Did you see that egg excellent? I love that. <laughs> there is no egg ignoring this egg that currently has more than 2.1 million likes so far. So not... Exactly. You're, you are the only person loving the puns. This is so funny. But Some of you guys, I see you almost on struggling. a daily basis. <laughs> it's a yeah, struggle. Every morning, bus. she's like, I can't yeah. breathe. You're Don't like, take my that? inhaler away. I really need that. I mean, the other day, April had to, you know, give her some mouth to mouth to keep it going. It was really odd. It was a life saving move, though. April, Nothing more. Is there any video? Oddly, we just got a really bizarre look into uh, his fantasy Sorry, life. Sorry, April. I'm pretty sure that didn't happen. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'd remember that. <laughs> oh, you'd remember. <laughs> yes. All right. I should advise her. That was awesome. a great comeback, Olivia. <laughs> now that none of us can read that solution advisory <laughs> for ozone. That, by the way. Get through it, April. Bring Whatever, it in. Jason. Wow. Oh, no, that. <laughs> Which we'll just take home with us today. Yeah, that's what <laughs> that's interesting. You all at home can think what you will about that trophy. I guess you could say if you get the trophy, you're the wiener. <laughs> oh my God. There you go. That was that was great, you guys. That's very impressive. Okay, what else are you putting on top of your toast here? They said you could remove the trophy to be in my ear, but I don't want to touch it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You can just leave it there. It's fine. Yeah, well, yeah whatever. Um, good luck. In a weird way, I hope you win and hope you don't win the trophy. Yeah, you right? Know? right? <laughs> you make a necklace Where do you put out it? of it. Do you mount it? I don't know what you do. <laughs> Please don't say that. Okay. <laughs> so, that's going to be it for Sports More News after this. Now it's time to use these... <laughs> To help sick people get better fast. Whoopsie, on to the next one. Mike's holding up his cup of coffee. Co goodness, cup, 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 cup of coffee. Cup of coffee this morning. So it is quite remarkable. It's not exactly clear. Politics. It's a little windy out here, Andrea. It's the biggest game on the biggest stage. Catch the foot. Sorry. <laughs> it's a little extra there. <laughs> a jewelry store wants to give mission. Michiganders. Michigan. They forecast a couple of spotty showers coming in tonight. As we go into tomorrow, we're going to see a cold and breezy day with those temperatures only in the 40s. There is Matt. Let's not let the NBA jam up your weekend plans. Instead, here are some tips and tricks to get around. Get around. <laughs> <coughs> Suffering into the beginning parts of the week. So we have cold weather safety. It's on this side. <laughs> <sighs> I've never used these graphics. <laughs> Photojournalist Richard Gordon shows us how one family adapted to give an expecting mom a memorial, a, mem memor mem a celebration that she'll always remember. The small business lobby says these changes are an improvement, but warns there may need to be even more if reopening goes <laughs> gentle. Right. And I'll have the max advantage forecast for you in just a few minutes. Well, thanks for. <laughs> <laughs> Gary, let's talk about the weather a, a little bit more. Gary, <laughs> I was trying to get coffee and I forgot that we, this wasn't a long weather. I'm here. Live Don't worry. Live TV, folks. All right, take it away. I'm going to let you do it. All right, well, the, well, the rain's <laughs> better stop for the moment in the Midwest. Forecasters warn it's only a sign of what is to come this spring. That's right, an update on the recovery efforts coming up in a live report. Now I'm getting now coffee. Now you can get your coffee. This is an area that was hit by the Latuna fire in 2017. So be careful when you drive through here. Look at that water that the car just went. We have been extremely active. Nine, six. And in public. In downtown oh, no. Ashley Lincoln at News 4. Thanks for staying up. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> We're not quite at the end yet. We got one more to go. Well, it was a homecoming that was never expected. <laughs>
Bridges and bridges are crumbling, only making water rescues even more dangerous. And on top of the hill, Essentia Health will soon be the new tenant inside the SMUD team up. The event that brought them together today, that's coming up.